Alright, well hello YouTube, this is Joseph Quick here, and I know I haven't made a video in months, but this is a topic I feel that really and truly needs to be talked about, mainly for people that are not in high school or going to college, or in college. Okay, that's the only topic for this video today, okay? I went to Panda Express today, right? And I noticed on the sign that they were for hire. Like, All right, let's see what the wages are. A manager is making 60000 a year plus bonus. An assistant manager is making $16 an hour. And remember, these are not very... Manager job is stressful. And the assistant manager, not as stressful as a manager. But they're both stressful positions, right? I'm working in the drilling industry, starting off at $14 an hour. And my job is so much more labor intensive and so much more stress than those two positions. I should be making more money than those. Because I feel as if those positions are for People in high school, going to college, about to go to college, or in between jobs. And then the manager's position should be more for people, should be more for lunch ladies. Lunch lady managers because they know how to do all this stuff. And they have to do it on such a large and massive scale. So if you think about that, right, it, how much sense does that make? My job is extremely stressful as a driller helper. And I'm starting off at $14 an hour. But yet you have an assistant manager and you have making $16 an hour. Then you have the kitchen and the staff making $12 an hour. Almost the exact same amount I'm making an hour. How much sense does that make? And all you really and truly work, you're either part-time or you're full-time. And how does that make sense? Because you just work your, you work your 40 hours a week and then you're done, right? My job, I don't just work 40 hours a week. I work closer to 55 hours a week. And a very labor-intensive and stressful job. Now, to me, that just does not make any sense, right? Why is it that my job is extremely more labor-intensive and stressful, and yet there's somebody that's either a high school student or a college student making the exact same amount, nearly making the same amount I'm making, I, I am making, to me, that makes absolutely no sense whatsoever. And they only work their 40 hours a week. You can divide it up six ways, seven ways, five ways. They're still going to get their 40 hours a week, and that's all that they work. But yet, I have to work six days a week unless, well, unless some very significant weather is coming through. Think about that, right? That does not make sense. And warehouse jobs. Think about that. An extremely labor-intensive job is starting off at $11.50 an hour. But then here's this high school student making $12 an hour, 50 cents more. Just to literally stand behind the counter and serve people food and just pass it on down to the next person. Whenever I was working at Subway, it was just me. Just me for two and a half months. Working by myself, making $8.50 an hour. To me, that makes absolutely no sense. Think about that. Working by myself, I'm working by myself. $8.50 an hour. That's all I, that's all I can make at the moment. 
in high school. But now here's high school students making twelve fifty an hour. I mean twelve dollars an hour. Four dollars more than I'm making by myself. So I'm guessing this is my rant about it, but if you think about it, right? If you're not going to college, you're not in high you're no longer in high school, but yet you have somebody making in those two more than me, or almost as much as me. Just because the job allows it. But think about that. But now, if you're in between jobs, and that's the only job you can get at the moment, that's different. Because you're having to get a job to where you can pay your bills. That can be overlooked. But you don't need to be 25 years old and that being your only job. And you're the slowest person there, but yet you cannot be fired because they don't have anybody to fill that position. Go out and get you a job that you can get a trade in. Me? Drilling. I do. I work on the rig. Rig, I hook up the pipes, other known as joints, together. And I do maintenance. And I'm always covered in mud, but yet I'm also learning how to work with wires and all this other stuff. That is a tradesman job. But yet here's somebody not getting a trade other than how to serve people food at 18, 19, 20, 25, whatever years of age. To me, that makes absolutely no sense. Alrighty, I just wanted to throw this out there and essentially make this a rant, but stop and think about that as well. Just think about that for a minute. Alrighty, this is Joseph Quick, signing off, and remember, be prepared.